Welcome to Inside the Studio with Greg Worth. And in this episode, I'm going to demonstrate a really cool plugin that just came out by Sound Toys. It's actually their first EQ. It's called the PsyQ, and it's modeled after a German EQ from the 60s by a company called Simons, and the model number is W295B. It's held in high regard as a really fat and smooth, warm sounding EQ. Going over the parameters, it's got a low band, so it's got a fixed frequency. And then in the mid band, it's switchable between six different frequencies. And the high band is fixed, and it's also got a drive knob, so you can get a little saturation out of it. Just for this example, I got a, a, a drum track here by itself, and I wanted to show what it sounded like using on the kick drum, snare, and also the room mics. So just to start, I'll give you an example of what the drums sound like without the EQs engaged. So it's not too bad. It was tracked with some compression and EQ, and I've went ahead and added a little more compression uh, just to get a little punch out of it. So let's take a listen to what the kick drum sounds like with this EQ engaged. So as you can see, it's it made it sound really fat and punchy. So I added, you know, maybe about five dB here on the low end, and then I'm cutting 2 dB at 700 Hertz. And then I'm adding about 9 dB again on the top end and just 2 dB of drive. Let's hear that in context of the track. So very nice. It's a really awesome EQ. Let's take a listen on the snare bus here. This is what the EQ sounds like without it. And then I'll engage it. So doing a little similar about almost 3 dB on the low end, adding a little body to it, and then 4 dB at 5.6 kilohertz. So it's adding a nice little snap to it, snap or a crack, and then a little top, top end sheen at about 6 dB and a tiny bit of drive. So let's take a listen to this in the track in context. So you can see it just adds a little fatness and it makes it poke out of the track and it gives a little excitement to it. Okay, so next let's check out the room mics I got here, stereo room. So I'm doing a little bit of a similar thing here, quite a bit of low end, about 7 dB, and I'm adding a 5.6 kilohertz again, about 5 dB, and a little bit of top end here and a little bit more of drive. So let's take a listen. So that's quite impressive. That actually turned that into something very exciting and very usable. Let's hear that in context of the track now. So it just, it adds a lot of excitement to the overall track. It's like, you know, the tones weren't bad, but it was kind of dull and boring. Now let's listen to the track with all the EQs bypassed and then I'll engage them and we'll kind of hear it in full context of what these EQs are doing to just these three sources on the drums.
So there you have it. The exciting thing is that this plugin is actually free. Uh, it's for a limited time. So this is a killer plugin EQ. I'm definitely going to add this to my arsenal. Thanks for watching Inside the Studio with Greg Worth. And please subscribe to the channel and the newsletter on my website. And I'll check you out next time.